Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am here with a careful review of this particular game. <laughs> I mean, guys, I normally don't play anything that is a little controversial. I did get a request to review this game. It's called Succubus, and I will say that it is probably way outside what I would normally do as far as my channel. I honestly felt like I needed to do a review because they did ask me to. I felt like that was the proper thing to do. But the footage in here is over the top for my channel, honestly. And I thought I'd at least give it a shot because it does have uh, censorship that's added because there is nudity. Without a doubt, there is nudity. Uh, and I thought that would be enough, you know, because I've dealt with blood and gore, I've played zombie games, but this kind of goes a little over the top in violence, and just in general stuff that, if you're a religious person, maybe a little more than they could handle. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I will say this much, though. I will say this much. This game has amazing graphics amazing graphics it is actually very much like playing doom uh, as far as the gameplay goes and you know you're dealing with you know obviously monsters are from hell and you're actually one of the members of the, the place a female that is pretty much uh, not clothed at all <laughs> Yeah, that's why I have a little bit of an issue with it. But I will tell you, for the game it is, and for the gameplay, this is an excellent game. It is very well put together, very well made. Seems to have a good story-driven line. Um, not sure how much footage I can actually show you guys, because like I said, there's just some stuff in there that's, you know, definitely do not let kids see this. Do not let kids see this. I'm not even sure some sensitive people should see this, <laughs> but if you like Doom games and that kind of stuff doesn't bother you, this game would be great for you. And if you're a little more over the top, it even has the ability to take the censorship off. But definitely guys, this is not the kind of game I would do a series on in my channel, strictly because I am a family based channel. So. But I feel like, like I said, I need to do a review. So I'm going to try to jump in and show you a little bit of gameplay footage that, you know, if I edit it, the dickens out of it, maybe you can kind of get a, a, a gist of what the gameplay is like. Okay, guys, this is the first... <laughs> I've already played into about five minutes and none of it I could really use. It was just a little too intense. I mean, this is bad enough. I mean, it's pretty, pretty visual. Looks like rivers of blood. Ugh. And I won't even discuss what's going on up there. But I'm just coming in showing how you can break things. Like I said, carefully going to try to edit things so this isn't too much to deal with. Okay, what's going on over there? I am not, I don't want you guys to see. So, what I gotta do is I gotta find the weapon, and I'm gonna go over there, get the weapon, and then see if there's a portion that I can show you. Okay, there's the weapon. I'll, there's things on either side of this that I cannot let you see. But this is just showing you how do you interact. These are the weapons you get. They look kind of almost skeletal in a way. I don't know if the weapons get better as you go. I played a little bit into this. But, like I said, I'm trying to be careful not to expose anything that's a little bit too over the top for my channel. Not easy. 
<laughs> not easy it is. But basically you have to kill things with this. Alright, now it's showing us about alternative attacks. I had to skip a whole good portion of that, guys. But this is just showing us that we can throw certain weapons and use them for different types of attacks. Now let me see if there, this is okay to, to do. Yeah, so far this, as ugly as this room is, it is... Oh, that's not good. It's passable, but basically what you do is you just hold it, throw it, whatever that is, releases. And that gets us to the next level, and... Well, I can't let you go in there too far, that's a little bit too iffy. Some things can just be broken. I don't know why, I guess it's just for aesthetics. But anyway, we're going to attempt to go in here without exposing too much again. Not easy. I might be able to blur some of this out, I don't know. But we're going to jump down here. And I'll show you how we do fighting. I think we just need to throw that at him. Nope, we got actually fighting. Executions. Ooh. This is pretty bloody, guys. Some of the stuff is extremely, extremely bloody. Well, let me go ahead and you press shift to execute, literally. You're not worth my time. And this is the special powers on the right of your mouse that you can kill the creatures trying to come down and eat you. So let's give that a try. So that pretty much. Like I said, very doom like. Very doom like. Alright, guys, I had to end it. There was just so much stuff that I couldn't get around. Yeah, this is, like I said, this is not for kids. This isn't for teenagers. This is strictly for adults, both in, even with the censorship, guys. And, like I said, this is not for everyone. This is. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> Honestly, it's a it's actually a very good game. It's very well made. I don't know what these guys have put together in the past, but I will say that the if they put together any kind of adventure game, it would be awesome. It would be definitely awesome. A survival game, I would be there for sure. Um uh, but this is over the top. <laughs> this is over the top. But if you love this kind of game, if you like to be a little bit, you know, rebellious, well, you know, this game would be great, guys. You could have a lot of fun. It's basically Doom in Hell. That's what it is. I mean, I know Doom is supposed to be in Hell, but not like this. But anyway, guys, my review is that this is an excellent game. It really, actually, really is an excellent game. It's very well put together the graphics are great um, again too over the top for my channel so anyway I'd be like, you know let that be your own decision and for parents out there watch out for this one the name alone ought to tell you this is not the game for any of your kids anyway guys as I always say aim straight cast far and have fun Anyway, guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later with some more appropriate stuff. Bye. <laughs>